everybody. So for today's card, I started off with the Paper Smooches Boob Tubes stamp set. This stamp set just cracks me up. I had to use it for one of my Valentine's cards. So I grabbed the one little um, television image and inked it up with my Memento Tuxedo Black ink and then stamped it onto some Stampin' Up! Crumb Cake cardstock that I had already die cut with a Spellbinder Circle die. And then I wanted to paper piece the screen part of it, so I just did that before coloring just because I had the piece of paper sitting in the way. So I inked up the set again, stamped it onto this striped pattern paper, and then grabbed this little, I don't even know what you call it, almost like a little tiny lightning bolt type stamp, and then just inked it up the three times um, to kind of make basically static lines across this little screen, and then trimmed it out, and then went on to coloring um, the TV. So very simple, I just used a C3 marker for um, the gray areas just quickly filled that in and then for the TV set itself I did E23 and then added just a little bit of E25 just along the bottom just to give it a little something extra again no fancy blending or anything just quickly filled it in and then quickly with the E23 just went over a little bit so it just blended nicely and then for the little buttons I just used the E25 again and then for uh, just to ground it a bit I just used my W3 and then the W1 and when you're coloring on like craft card stocks like this, um, it looks really messy because you can see where the marker is still wet. So just keep in mind that as it dries, it's not going to look like this just looks like I made a big mess. It doesn't look nice at all. But you always got to remind yourself as it dries, it just fades out nicely. Because I blended out with the W00 and then finally the 0. So it'll just be a nice light shading. But right now it just looks like nothing. So... Just quick, simple, once that's done, it's time to glue on the little paper piece screen. So Tumble Mono Multi, get that all glued down. And as always, so it's not just floating there, um, I just took my W3 marker and just went around the edge with it. And that's all there was to it. So super quick and simple. And then I framed that with a piece of Stampin' Up's not quite navy cardstock that I cut with a larger Circle Spellbinders die. And then I'm, the pattern paper I'm using is from the Echo Park Times and Seasons. So this is a totally non-traditional Valentine's card. There's no pinks or reds or black or anything like that. Um, yeah, definitely a guy card. And you'll see why once I finish the inside. I get, I just, I was snickering the whole time I was making this. This set just killed me. I love it. <laughs> so I cut just a bunch of random strips of pattern paper. Like this card is just nuts. Like crazy busy and I don't know, I had fun with it. So cut all these random strips of pattern paper, adhered them with no rhyme or reason whatsoever. Just slapped them on the card front. Um, got everything down. And then for the sentiment, this is also from the Boob Tube stamp set. I just grabbed one of the more neutral pattern papers, inked up the news flash, and stamped that onto the pattern paper. So once I've got that stamped, I trimmed it down with my paper trimmer. And then decided to notch the ends kind of like a little um, flag. So just eyeballed it, used scissors, cut the ends down, just like so. And then I grabbed some, this is Honeydew Twinery Twine. So it was kind of the closest shade to match kind of the green in the pattern paper. So I wrapped that around the card front and then tied it in a bow, just like so. And then just like figured out how I wanted my layout to be so just kind of move the bow over a little bit and then for the little flag I decided to attach it with mini brads so just pierced hole stuck in a little black mini brad and then put one in the bottom of it and that's all there was so once I've got that the little main image of the TV to attach that to the card I just grabbed a bunch of dimensionals so that it would kind of stand up a little bit more and also go over the twinery twine really well and yeah, that's it for the card front. So flipped it over, put tape over the edges of the twine so that the ATG doesn't catch on it when I put that on. And then adhered that to the card base, which again, the Stampin' Up! Not Quite Navy cardstock. And adjusted that little bow because it was driving me nuts. So once I got that, I go into the inside of the card, which I kept super simple. Had it all planned out. Um, I just grabbed a piece of pattern paper again from the same pack. And then another piece of the crumb cake cardstock that I had cut down a little bit. Got that into place and then grabbed the main sentiment from the Boob Tubes stamp set. Inked that up with the tuxedo black. 
And that's why this card just kills me. I love that sentiment. <laughs> I'm probably going to give this to my husband for Valentine's Day because I just think it's funny. So yeah, stamp that. Colored in the little plug-in with the C3 marker. Added a strip of the straight pattern paper that I used on the front. And that's all there was to it. Just quick and simple and funny and not girly at all. So, as always, links to everything will be in the description box below the video. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.